Hi friends. So we had an excursion. Got canceled. My mom did not get a refund. Not good. Time to scan my medallion. It's time to get off. We are in Genoa, Italy. We're back in Italy again. Yes. But the disappointing part is, well, okay, I don't know which is more disappointing, the France excursion itself or this getting absolutely canceled on us. So that kind of sucks. I can't believe she really didn't get a refund on the tickets. But anyways, good morning. It's actually really windy out there. And you know what today? And it looks like it's gonna storm and rain. Why? Why? But hey, I can't give it a point. It's pretty. It's usual. Okay, so now there's dust in my eye. What the heck, man? I think we need to get a bus. I don't think anybody can hear me. Mainly because of the fact. Mainly because of the fact that there's wind literally blowing on my phone. That kind of sucks. And... Yeah, let's go. Well, this is kind of disappointing for a day. <sighs> it's not all sunny and pretty. It's all cloudy and dreary. Just like it is in Colorado. Well, this was different. Especially for Italy. This is not what I honestly expected. The lights are on. The clouds are going over. It's extremely dark out here, and it's extremely dark in here too. Like, it doesn't even look like daytime. It looks like it's, it's night. It looks like it's night. And that's our ship. Cause I just want to zoom in again. That's this is the most dis. I don't know which is more disappointing, the France excursion or this, or our excursion for today getting canceled. <sighs> this is one heck of a trip so far. I thought this was going to be at least decent, at the very least. There are people going into this other bus here. We're gonna be heading out, but oh gosh, all these clouds could clear out. I think they will probably very soon, but yeah, I don't know if I'm gonna be filming that much today because honestly, it's sunny and pretty. But I guess there's always gotta be a dreary day out of them. <sighs> it's okay though. We'll get on with the tour in a few minutes, so I will end the vlog here for now. Stay tuned. And uh, after that, after road, the visit of the Firinos, one of the uh, uh, most elegant, most famous, and best restaurants we have in the city of Genova. And this afternoon, we spent some time in Genova, in the city of Genova. For those who are into it, will be a short guided tour with me. A guy, a local guide, as I said. And then some free time, for free time and then a visit, we decide and on the tour. And after that, we'll be back to the ship this afternoon together. Um, before I start providing any commentary, I ask you to help me please, now I have to sit, help me please draw up a list of the people of the bus. Due to the fact that uh, uh, we are visiting Santa Margarita, there will be some free time before we meet 
again to go to, to Portofino and uh, uh, this afternoon will be some free time for you to visit Genova and before we get back I have to be sure that everybody is at the meeting. Uh, we're meeting in places where uh, everybody can find so you shouldn't have problems. Then the 47 Museum of Photography, that's a small side, so you can't get lost there. But we have to be sure that everybody is uh, at the meeting, nobody is late. So I ask you please to uh, help me draw up a list of the people on the bus. I do not need a detailed list with every single name or person because you know the people you are with. Uh, so he's a person in a group is not at the meeting, the others know and let me know, of course. What I need is uh, a family name or uh, well, uh, well, uh, initials, uh, or some reference, uh, even the first name, a uh, cabin number and the n number of people who are together. Uh, in the sense that I must have 40 people and in case uh, well, for for instance, Mrs. Margaret Whitehead with two grandchildren, I need Whitehead, three people and the cabin number, uh, or Margaret or MW, it doesn't matter. What is important is the cabin number and the number of people together. If the children, in this case, if the children don't have their grandmother's name, it doesn't matter at all, because names are just references for the list. Um, and I'm not asking your your ID, he just uh, helped me. If you are Mrs. and Mr. Ford with three children, I need Ford, five people, and the cabin number. If you prefer to write Margaret and Colin, their names is the same. M C is uh, the same. Uh, anytime we leave a site, I ask you to come to me and I'll check in. I'll take the names. Essential is a cabin number because in case somebody is not at the meeting, somebody doesn't show up after fall the ship and I can't say a lady whose first name is Anne because we may have a two there may be two or three Anne's on the bus. I also wrote an emergency number at the bottom of the list. You will not need it but it's a sort of insurance you know we pay insurances in order not to use now that. It's a number of uh, one of the managers of the staff managers of Alosky the local agent responsible for the tour should you need any assistance during your free time please do not hesitate to get in touch with it's Eleonora and uh, you will find the it's a mobile phone you will find plus three nine it's the Italian code if you want to take a photograph of uh, the number which is at the bottom of the list and uh, I don't know whether you have to dial, depends on that, on your operator, but 39 plus 39 is the number of Italy. Now I pass the list, and as soon as it's ready, if you would be so kind to let me have it back. Thank you. Now. supposed to sit along the way but uh, okay uh, we, when you arrive had to give you I should have given you but it was raining so we just rushed on the bus uh, yeah. number, the number. if you want to make a photograph take a photograph of a number or just write it down of course, it's at the bottom of the list. Uh, can, I pass it? can you pass it to everybody? Okay, thank you. Uh, there are some mini radios I have to give you. I usually give uh, to each passenger while they are getting on the bus, but it was raining, it was beginning to rain too fast, so it 
to speed up things I didn't give them. Uh, now I'll pass the arms first to sit. I'll pass and give you the radius one by one, little by little, because I'm supposed to sit. The uh, I can't do th two things together. So little by little, I'll give you the main radius. I'll start now so that you can listen to me during our tour. Because uh, it was very hot <laughs> in yeah. Chile yesterday, so yeah, yes, the air conditioning, they were just adjusting the ideal temperature. People were complaining because it was too low, but uh, now, yes, yes, today is, yeah, yeah, <laughs> yes, okay, yes. We should get to the idea of temperature in a few minutes. Okay. <laughs> The channel is already on, so please don't change the channel. Thank you very much.
Because it's raining like crazy out here. I'm not like raining. We're in Genoa now. So that's nice. I got mine on. She's got hers on. She's got hers on. You know the girl. Let's see what we can find, I guess. I got it. Everybody's going through this tent here, or whatever it is. You can see all these pretty, pretty flowers. That's why I like Naples. They got such beauty. They got such beauty in their stuff. I wish we had more time in Naples, though. That's the only thing. Actually, that's kind of for all the places kind of deal. Even for Coda. Coda, I only got like a couple of souvenirs because. Well, I had to rush in and get souvenirs actually for Coda. We didn't even have time to shop that day. But it was only like um, Santorini and Coda that we had to ride a boat instead of an actual. Instead of just getting off of the port. After that, we could just get off of the port. That's for Barcelona and for Rome and for the third place that drop off people. I'm not doing the whole three week cruise type deal. I'm doing only two. Yes! So far, What's here? What in time is that? Empire the city. All right. This is an Italy newsstand. That's a cute dog. And these are beautiful flowers. Just the flies. They're just so pretty. Oh, yes. Another normal day in Italy, I see.
raining and the like crazy out here. And I'm gonna get him to eat that later. Awfully gloomy day, and I decided to wear my tennis shoes. So that sucks. I can't believe that all freaking days. This sucks. stopped raining and it's all oh, fully beautiful what okay uh, maybe I'll get one later huh okay I guess we can check it out whatever this is I don't know oh there's heart-shaped cookies. Okay, that's cute. I think I want one. Cacti, flower, whatever those are. Well, picturesque. Ah, yes. Many euros. Torta papavero, along with torta di casta. Okay, fine, I'll come. This is the lovely view of Genoa, Italy. This is why Italy is probably my favorite country of them all. This is the one time where I don't mind the sun. Oh, there's some, uh, is that? Magnets. Oh, yeah. Yes, yes, yes. Not just that. <laughs> done tolling so I don't know what that is is that <gasps> oh I get it it's on the hour so it was around 10 o'clock so I think that bell tolled 10 times it's kind of like whipping the I don't know how many times that thing tolled geez I don't keep count we're gonna be heading back to the bus for our next stop I forgot where our next stop is because our excursion got canceled. <sighs> Fingers crossed because I'm actually excited for this new excursion tomorrow. Okay, so the ladies are ready for to go. And yes, in case you guys are wondering, I changed the picture resolution to a different brand. I didn't even notice I had that picture, so. Let's leave a passage because. Okay, it's on People, 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 people. Why do we need to get around? Yeah. Just stay here. I'm just gonna fall around because it's like nail holes. These people. Okay, now this is gorge. People.